you gotta get uh, these legs. I've seen him in my gym with uh, one of my Division One wrestlers, Kyle Kretschmer. He had him in a choke that I thought, oh shit. I go, I'm gonna see him tap for the first time ever. And God damn it, he didn't tap. He just relaxed, he relaxed, and next thing you know, Kyle got out of the hole that I, I don't know how the hell he does it. I've never seen him tap and Disagree with Brian Ortega because he's too small. He's a 145 say. pounder. Oh, he's a huge one. Yeah, but he's a 145 oh, pounder. Ferguson is the man. I'm training like way more than I ever have. You know, I think because I stayed like nine months, you know, without without competing, you know, and basically without training, you know, it's kind of just. I think I, before I got pregnant, I was a little bit like um, burned out, you know, just like training so much and compete, fighting all the time and people talking about like the weight cuts and everything. So I kind of was good for me to clear my mind. I just talked to Mackenzie a few days ago. And um, she told me that she is planning on doing another match by the end of the year would be her goal. And then um, after she fights, we're gonna look at it and see how she's feeling and try to schedule something out. We're, we're gonna be pretty gangster about that shit at ADCC. But we're gonna be like literally kicking people out left and right for using their cell phones. That's the only thing I'm willing to let people film. If they catch the BJJ Sierra guy and he gets the shit kicked out of him, I want everybody videotaping it and posting it on Instagram. <laughs> IBJJF has made the decision that they're going to drug test people. And then certain people they made deals with, then get them to retire so that they no longer compete or something like that. You know, I don't care if people do steroids. I do steroids. I love steroids. I think Nate Diaz yeah, fucked that kid up in Sacramento super bad. And Nate was coaching and this guy was like flicking water on him. And Nate was like, as soon as the match, like his kid, it was a kid's match, kid gets off, hugs him, you know, and he literally walks over to the dude and beat the shit out of him. Like the dude's face was like completely busted up. And like, and that one, like nobody, nobody's like trying to jump in and stop yeah, me. No. I just ran over and grabbed him. And I was like, get the f out of here. You're going to get fucking sued. What are you doing? My body is still, you know, because I'm rolling now and I don't think I'm supposed to, but and he said, he goes, you, okay, what are you doing exactly in this jiu-jitsu thing? I go, uh, he goes, are people picking you up and slamming you? I said, no, 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 okay, that's good. But you're not like twisting or anything, are you? And I said, twisting? Uh -oh. Well, my nickname's mm -hmm. The Twister. <laughs> no, we're not <laughs> twisting. <laughs>